Hey everybody, great Friday to you. Listen, the saying or the phrase, do it afraid, is a very common one. I've operated under it, I've heard it, I've said it. And what that simply means is, if you have a situation or a task at hand that needs to be completed and you're scared, just do it anyway. Do it scared, all right? Do it afraid. You know, it'll eventually go away, just do it. But the fact of the matter is this, As believers in Christ, we don't have to operate that way. What do you mean? Well, 2 Timothy chapter 1 verse 7 says this, For God has not given us the spirit of fear, but of power, love, and a sound mind. So um, I believe it's in Matthew or Mark 16. Jesus says this, He will give us the keys to the kingdom of heaven. So he's going to give us access and how to operate um, under God's governing. He says, whatever you bind on earth shall be bound in heaven. He said, whatever you loose on earth shall be loosed in heaven. So this means if we're encountering those situations, again, we don't have to operate that way. All we have to do is bind that spirit of fear. And then we loose the power that God has given us over every situation. We loose the fact that we know that God loves us, we lose a sound mind so our minds aren't everywhere in that situation. So again, in a situation where you have to accomplish something and you're afraid, you don't have to be afraid. You don't have to operate under that fear. Just bind up that spirit and lose power, love, and a sound mind. God bless you. You be encouraged today. God loves you and his plans for your life are good. Bye-bye.